So here comes the boy from West Valley. He's in medical. Oh, and his testes or his sack is swollen up, swollen up like the size of a grapefruit here. They they had to send him back. Everybody says he's very sweet. Hi. Oh, he's, oh, he's got a beautiful face. Come here, baby. Pretty Come face. Here. Look at that. Oh, that has to hurt so oh badly. It is the size of a grapefruit. Okay, so it's a lipoma on the back here of his hip. And uh, it doesn't look nearly as bad in person as it does in the picture. I'll see if I can get my fingers around it in a minute. Oh, yeah, there you it's, go. Can yeah. you see? It's, it's you can move it around. Kind of you can get under there. And then you have another one up here somewhere. He said there was another one. I thought he said on, on the other side of his rump. I think but it's just this thing. You're talking about it's, this? this okay, so about. it does look like a callus, but... I wonder if that's a, an extra large ringworm. No. It's been there for years. They're both very round. This poor well, tail. He's got, he's got more. This on the poor tail is. Like, 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 yeah, yeah, like those are absolutely the chromas on his feet and his legs. I yeah. see those. Yeah, I see those. I saw those in the photo too. Yeah, from a you distance. can see a lot. Let's, in there. let's see his teeth. Let's see your teeth. Come here. All right. Oh, stop, honey. Let us look at your, we look at your teeth. We just want to see your teeth. We see your teeth. They're not great. And I mean, he's got a few white hairs on his face, but I swear, I still don't think he's five years old, even though his teeth, his, his teeth, his teeth look awful. Okay, so now we can go in the yard and we can let him, yeah, we can let him walk. And he is a sweet, sweet boy. Oh, my God. He's a cat dog who wants to just rub up on you. Yeah, I feel so sorry for him. With uh, that swelling. Oh my, poor baby. Now he did go back to the vet for that and he is being treated for it, but he it's still it there. He's for an ablation, hopefully, and an ablation. then said, no, I'm not going to do an ablation, let's put him on antibiotics. So they and put him on antibiotics, so that's okay. What he's on right now. Look at him, he's beautiful. He is. He's very sweet. He's a handsome boy. He is. Hi, sweetheart. He's a handsome boy. Hi. Yeah, I smell like a zoo. Well, nobody's out here. Can we? Let's let him walk. Uh, I can let, let him. Yeah, let him walk and smell I just don't everything. Want him jumping around too much. Yeah, I don't know that he will. He's. Yeah. No, I've had him out before. I had him out with a with a little female pit. Uh huh. Who's great with everybody. And she was bouncing back and forth with her oh, and he barking was. at her. But it, did he like her? They were friendly. He was, he was friendly. He was, he was friendly about it, but then a little nervous about it too, because yeah. he just was unsure what to do with her. <laughs> she was a little exuberant. Oh, I see. But, uh, yeah, his urine looks right okay. Now. It's yellow he urine. Blood in it anymore, but it has concerning the Okay. Time. Yeah, he did have blood. They've been treating him with Baytril, so. I don't know if that's for the urine or if that's for the swelling. Maybe both. Huh? He's a pretty boy. Look at him. So we've got to find a rescue for this boy. I mean, he's available for adoption. He's not rescue only. I just don't know too many people are going to take a dog who's beat up like this. Yeah, who's, who has the potential He's, for the medical bills. Yeah. They uh, thought that he could possibly have a bladder stone when uh, he had the problem with his urine. So, there, you can see him from a distance and see his gait. As with the pictures on Facebook, his face is just beautiful. And he's really pretty. He's a beautiful black. He's just... You know, he's got lichromas all over the place and calluses and I don't know what that is on his back and his hip. Somebody just certainly did not take care of this dog. That's what that is. Hi. Yeah, I'm friendly. I'm friendly. He's so skinny. He only weighed 118 pounds. They've got him up to 122. He's getting extra feedings. He gets fed three times a day. Three times a day. Okay. can't really see these too well. I don't know what they are. Oh, they're hard and oh. I see. I mean, if those are calluses where somebody had him confined, they better hope I never run into them. How anybody could 
treat dogs like this so bad, I will never understand. They're just a little they're, they're, little, uh, yeah, his tail is a little bit weird. I don't know if the fur's stuck together or what's going on there exactly, but the tail's a little bit weird. But he's very sweet. He's he's definitely cute. okay with people. We have no he idea leans, about children, but leans in. Great with kids. He is great with kids. I, I had him on leash inside last week when I walked him. Okay. And little two and a half, three year olds, little mm -hmm. girls shorter than he is. And he just wanted to. <laughs> He just wanted to stick his nose in her face, and he was wagging his tail, and, oh, nice. and she was reaching up and touching him, and he thought that was great. No, nice. no reactivity towards little kids and, okay. and their hands and stuff. Wasn't nervous about her. Uh, you're gonna come and see me, and I'm a complete stranger, but you'll come and see me. He is a lover. I love black gray Danes. <laughs> They're my favorite. You're a little. Ooh, somebody farted. <laughs> Ooh, I smelled that. Are we letting the air out? Sir? Yeah, he's a little bit young for my household. Letting the air out. Sir. You know, but he's pretty calm. I don't know if that's because he's got that giant, or got that little basketball little between his legs. He may not be feel like running and jumping around. Yeah. His teeth look good. It's just the back teeth need to be cleaned, but that could just be poor quality food and considering the shape he's in. With the lick gromas, he's been out in somebody's backyard, you know, they didn't take care of him. Right. And well, they Good thing that they he got loose. They weren't feeding him enough. Weren't and feeding him enough. And they had two because he came in yeah. with a harlequin that got adopted. It was a right merle. Away. It was a blue, right, blue right, merle. Right. It's a blue merle. Yeah. So, I hear the blue merle's lonely. He misses this boy. You know, we wish there was a way that we could keep the two dogs together. I just... I have yet to figure out a rescue that can do that. It's unusual for private parties to take two Great Danes when they go to adopt one. Okay, so here's some video. I think that uh, I didn't miss anything. Let me make sure that there's nothing going on here. Yeah, I don't see any hemangiosarcoma or anything like that, but he's a black dog. So, everything looks copacetic on this side. Let's take a look at this side. Yeah. I need, he's got a little, yeah, he's got a little fatty tumor there. Yeah. Let me take a look at your private parts there. They look good. Your private parts look good. Yes, they do. He's a big boy. Look at him. Yeah, he wants to be loved. They're they're people dogs and they're very loving, for the most what part. A he is, is he not? Yeah. yeah. He's so shiny. I just wish somebody would have taken better care of him. He's had a rotten life. Oh, oh my God. Oh yeah. We yeah. <laughs> you know, we sent him. We sent him back and. You can see your pretty face. Your face is beautiful. Your face is beautiful. Are you going to come and see me? No. It's, uh, what a sweetie. Oh, what a sweetie. Oh. So I wish I could take you myself. I do, I do. Especially if he, if he jumps around too much. But he's, he's pretty calm right now. Let me see. Oh, yeah, this is soft. Um, I can't really get my hands under it. Some, not all the way. I mean, it does feel like it's attached. So that may be a concern. I don't think he's that old. His face is very young. They they have him as five, but I don't think he's that old. He's starting to get fantastic. Well, they are in the front, but in the back they're not. And I, I think he just had crappy food, basically. But yeah, the teeth in the front look pretty young. Yeah, I don't know what that is. That's all. Despite his little bumps and lumps. Exactly. Yeah, and he's a sweet boy. I think we all got some Often, often the dogs that come from the worst environment are the most loving and the most grateful for the least little kindness you show to them. I, I pull a lot of Danes out of North and South Central. Those dogs are, they get more of them than anybody else. And, and those dogs, uh, you know, they run in the street. They're really socialized because they run wild. And 
They're just so happy to have a home and regular meals. Okay, so here's the video on the boy at West Valley. I've forgotten his name. Did you guys name him? Um, what's his name again? Rutherford. 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 Yeah. Rutherford. That's, that's his a great name. name. It is a great name. <laughs> Rutherford. That's a Rutherford. very distinguished name. Or Rutherford. Do you know that name? Do you know that name? Rutherford. Well, he knows people, that's for Mr. certain. Mr. Rutherford III. 